So following day, um, got it up in the shop, got it all taken apart except for the gears on the inside. I can't get them Allen bolts loose. Need to get a a ten millimeter one for my impact because they're Allen heads and a regular Allen wrench ain't cutting it. Both of those, both of those broken. The only one of the those that didn't break is the end one. That's up in the tower on that side still. The one that's up in the tower on this side, you can see the bolt there. I threaded it back in. I took that one out. That's that one there on top. And pretty much every gear in this thing is broken. I think the only one that would be usable is that one there. I think I only found one little nick and one little tooth, but the rest of them are all broken in one way or shape or form. Um, especially that one. And then, to make matters worse, and I think this has been like this for a little while now, <laughs> supposed to have that block there and the two notches for your front bolts for your rock guards. And, um, as it turns out, because you can't see this with the rock guards on there. As it turns out, the cutter bar is cracked from there all the way down to here. And where that piece ended up that's got the other two of these and four of these... Where it went, I don't know. It broke off somewhere, sometime along in life. And, uh, of course, like I said, you can't see that with the rock guards on. So, a friend of ours has a parts machine that I think, I gotta go look at it, has the same cutter bar in it. And if that's the case, and try to talk him into selling it to us because it's going to be easier than trying to deal with this thing. Um, really not worth putting a new cutter bar in as expensive as they are. Although, there really isn't much else wrong with that one other than the skirting is kind of ripped up. And it could use new tires. One of them we got to put air in once in a while. Other than that, the thing was working just fine. We just put new hoses on it this year. And... Kind of disappointing, but... I thought what happened was the route guards broke. But they didn't. Um, those were flopping before this happened. And... Uh, now it turns out it broke that whole piece, and that's... That's actually the bottom half of the cutter bar that's cracked right there. So. That really sucks. But. That's all part of it, I guess. We went and looked at a mower not too far here from us. Um, a few days ago, before I took this all apart. And uh, that one needs a little bit of work. Nothing like what this one needs. Um... We might buy it. It's a 920 John Deere MoCo. Older one. Um, we might buy it just to get us by for now because we've got more to cut. But, uh... I'm going to go over and see him about that. 
he's got a coon mower that they stopped using because the tower on this end was fucked and they got a new mower or new to them mower. I don't need the tower. There ain't nothing wrong with our tower. It's the cutter bar we need. Supposedly the cutter bar was good in it because they were using it up until that happened to the tower. So if it's the same, and I think it is, if it's the same, because that mower is also a 250 like this one is. If it's the same cutter bar, and it had good tires on it too, which we could use on this. We might just buy that for parts and uh, take the cutter bar out of it. Wheels and tires off of it onto ours. And who knows, we might still buy that other mower too and then we'd have two of them. But I know the last time we bought one of those was four or five years ago. And I believe they were like 170 bucks then. A piece. And we need all three of the middle ones. So. I said every gear in this thing is broken. To some degree. Except for the very, very end one right there. And then the one that's still up in the tower on the other side. That one's fine. And that one there on the end is fine. But all the rest of them all the way down through are broken. And those two and the other ones over there on that rock guide there underneath that other gear. Are all broken. So between that and all that, cutter bar is pretty fucked. So we'll see what happens.